that already this year on a punt return. And Barry Alvarez would love nothing more than to get another one here. Williams had a touchdown catch a few moments ago. In the process, tying a school receiving record. Lawrence Maroney has done a lot of heavy lifting today. Well, if that's the call, if you want to say, would it? Gutsy. <laughs> I call it something else. Gutsy or crazy, depending on the outcome of it. There's a look at Mellon. 35 seconds to go. Mellon did a lot of work in the offseason. Went to kicking camp out in California. Trying to refine his mechanics. Be 44 for 4, 40 to 49. So ideally, with the tie left, that would be suitable field position for the Wisconsin offense to give him a chance. They've got to get into field goal range, though. Kusek now will punt. Minnesota needs a good effort from him. But they need a good effort from their cover team, Mark, because number one, Brandon Williams back there, who, as you mentioned earlier, has taken one back this year to return the football. Big Ten Conference Special Teams Player of the Week a few weeks ago. Here's the punt coming from Kusek. Oh, he fumbled it! It's lost! Unbelievably! Wisconsin with a chance to pounce! Who's got it? Touchdown, Badgers! Unbelievable! Simply shocking!
the 115th position of Minnesota and Wisconsin will go down in the book as a miraculous turnaround for Barry Alvarez in his last game against Minnesota. His 16th and all. And for Minnesota, it will go down as a rancorous, bitter, bilious defeat. You can't think of a worse scenario for a meltdown. The final score, 38 to 34. A conciliatory handshake for Glenn Mason from Barry Alvarez. And the axe remains headed for the goalpost. Dante Sanders, the linebacker, chopping it down. And with it, chopping down the hopes of Minnesota, remaining perhaps in the conference race. Can't believe it. Lawrence Maroney, a career day for him. He ran for 258 yards. Gary Russell also with an incredibly productive day. He ran for 139, but the smile will take a while to come back for Maroney. This day belongs to the Badgers. From the shores of Lake Minnetonka and Lake Monona, everything in between, it's all Badgers at the end. For Dave Ryan and Chris Spielman and our entire crew, I'm Mark Jones. There's been a presentation of ESPN, the worldwide leader in sports.